Election 2012, folks, this morning we are tracking what you are saying on social media. A lot of you waking up to the results from the presidential election, even some local elections here. Let's take a look right now on Facebook and let's see what people are tweeting about when it comes to the election. A lot of people waking up and tweeting our neighbors to the south made a great decision with yesterday's presidential election. That one coming from Michael Julian Reds posting this just five seconds ago. There was an election, question mark. I want to talk about some of the things trending on Facebook yesterday during the actual election. The top five words used on Facebook yesterday, vote, ballot, Romney, election, and Obama. So a lot of people using social media to kind of get the word out about election day. Taking a look at Twitter, the Twindex, as they pull it as, election.twitter.com, Barack Obama winning when it comes to Twitter, 74 to Mitt Romney's 59. And there's actually a Twindex going on through Twitter where they literally tracked what people were talking about. Yesterday around 2 p.m. is when the peak time of people heading out to the polls. You can see Obama with 71 percent as opposed to Romney's around 68 percent of voters that were tweeting and talking about the election. Now last night after Obama was reelected, a huge dip from people talking about Obama and Romney, a huge dip for Romney, about 18% of people tweeting about Romney on Twitter. And then as people are waking up this morning, it's kind of the same, about 92 tweets coming in about President Obama as opposed to Romney right now. Want to note this about Twitter, 327,000 tweets per minute after President Obama's announcement of him being reelected. So a lot of people waking up and getting this news and using social media to get the word out and share what they're feeling. And we're going to find out what's trending all morning here on Good Day Columbia. So stay with us. Got more. Well, the election may be over, but people are certainly not done talking about it. And waking up this morning, here's what's trending across social media in terms of Facebook and Twitter right now. Some people sharing their thoughts on Facebook. John Cook says the only thing about the election that's bad that's being over. The political ads have been replaced by Christmas car commercials. Some people kind of glad that it's over, but now moving on to other things. Leslie says, truth and election means nothing. The Lord reigns, let the earth rejoice. That's what's happening on Facebook. I want to take you now to some other websites. Twitter political index here. Twitter's kind of election headquarters. President Obama winning when it comes to tweets as opposed to Governor Mitt Romney and We'll take a look at one more website, Poly Pulse, really giving a complete dashboard on election coverage this morning in terms of who's tweeting and what they're tweeting about, the tweets coming in. Also giving a number on people who are actually following the president's official Twitter page as opposed to Governor Mitt Romney's Twitter page. 1.77 million following Mitt Romney's official Twitter handle and president's 22.49 million. And to talk about Facebook a little bit, yesterday while people were out hitting the polls, the top five terms people were searching on Facebook, looking at vote, ballot, Romney, election, and Obama. So a lot of people waking up to the news and sharing their thoughts via social media. Yesterday, after President Obama's re-election announcement, 327 thousand tweets per minute so definitely an election year where social media definitely thrive and we've, we're going to keep tracking what's trending we want you to share your thoughts with us tweet us at watch fox and on facebook and share your comments we've got more good day in just a bit